am I a fun dad? And if I am, well, then you could just be, it could be just a quick one for your answer. If you just say, am I a fun dad? And what makes me a fun dad? You could just say, <clears throat> no. And then, you, and then you'd be done. So you wouldn't have to answer the rest of the question. I feel like you have answered for me. Tyson? All right. Then Tyson, go first. So let me break, break, break it all down for you. I ain't never giving up. I ain't never giving up. You know I'm going to take, take, taking that crown from you. I ain't worried about you. I ain't never So let me break, break, break it all down for you. I ain't never giving up. I ain't never giving up. You know I'm going to take, take, taking that crown from you. I ain't worried about Welcome What's up, back. freaks? Welcome to another episode of the Breaking the Cycle podcast. I am. I'm doing the intro because we're doing things a little differently today. This is a three part part series. And if you guys have been tuning in previously, you may know the that series. this one interrupts me every time I'm talking. You may know the series where we asked him questions, but now we're gonna switch it up a bit. That's what I was getting at. So this is a three-part series of 15 things that men want to know about their kids. Yeah. yeah. So some of these things we talked about, some of the questions we talked about, and some of them, they don't know what the questions are going to be. And some of them I might regret dun, by dun, dun. not letting them prepare for these because who knows, who knows what's going to come out of their mouths when they're asked some of these questions. So we're going to jump into this. It's 15 things that men, that fathers want to know about their kids. And it's broken up into kind of three categories. This first one's kind of just a family-ish, personal-ish type of category that we're going to start with. Why are you breathing so heavily over there? Are you nervous or something? Or did you just run up a flight of stairs or some crap? It's It's been a long day. You literally woke up at like noon. <laughs> <laughs> what time is that it is now? That is very is it personal. Like, is it like three or like something? I don't know. Your mic, that mic sounds better than these most. Stop. What are you doing? <laughs> heavy bright. Heavy bright. God. I'm All right. So, so let's get this started. The guys, first question. What are we going to do? Suspenseful. They are very nervous for this. Mid- um, Midge is going to be ask, Midge is gonna be going first, right? I'm a little nervous. It just makes more sense. Yeah, sometimes. And sometimes you're going to go first. Sometimes. So you don't always get to prepare and, and think about what your answer is going to be. Why are you so nervous? Jeez. I've never seen these two so... Look at this. Hands fiddling, twiddling with wires. <sighs> Having panic attacks. You know, I'm going to lower my volume a bit so you guys don't hear me as much. Freaking panic attacks. We still hear you very loudly. All right. So let's do this. We're going to go right off. We're going straight to some of the hard stuff. What? Cut right to the bone. (laughs) I'm going to ask this this question and I'm going to to regret some of these asking this because we we don't edit these videos. We just go record it and put it out there. So all we edit is add like an intro and then like a trailer in the beginning of it. Am I a fun dad and what makes me fun? Midge, you're going to go first. First of all, first of all, what, what, like what makes you just, what makes you immediately think you're a fun dad? Like that, like that's, that's. Why do you have to look at your book to say that? Do you like write down like. Your, I need to say that he's not a fun. Your dad. shit talking notes down there. What the heck? Oh, what happened? Do you uh, write? Do you write down your like crap talking notes down there? So, all right. So let let's do it. No, but that's like that's like that's like saying, "Are you embarrassed? You wet the bed this morning?" Like no matter what you say, no matter how you answer, it's no matter what you say, it's gonna be yes. What? I don't get the. You, you don't understand that? No. You, you, no. This is like that dishwasher river thing that time. <laughs> it went on for like dishwasher, 50. Dishwasher, and then the river went. It was like your word. It was like your theme the of the dishwasher. year. Oh, no, it was life is a, and you said a river, and it turned to this like 15 dishwasher. minute like lecture on the dishwasher or something. I, I still, think I fell asleep during that episode. I'm still trying to decipher that one. I'm still have. No, some but PTSD like that's, that's, that. that's like saying, like, are you embarrassed you went to bed this morning? Like, if you say no, that means you're not embarrassed. But if you already you, went over that. We didn't get it. I still you, didn't get you, it. You, you guys are something else. Something like, else. <laughs> That's for yourself. That's for yourself. All right, so, so Midge, mean. you're going first. Am I a fun dad? And if I am, well, then you could just be, it could be just a quick one for your answer. If you just say, am I a fun dad? And what makes me a fun dad? You could just say, <clears throat> no. And then, you, and then you'd be done. <laughs> so you wouldn't have to answer the rest of the question. I feel like you have answered for me. Tyson? <laughs> All right, then Tyson go first. <laughs> no, so um, first of all, um, hold on, notes. Tyson, notes. This isn't one that you have notes on. Like, am I a fun dad? What makes me fun? I want to hear it. Okay. I want to yeah. hear it from and, you. And to answer your question. Because think about so. this. this is a, it sounds like a stupid, simple question, but it's 
it's important. And this yeah. is, we do it because we we are we do this kind of stuff. We could do it on a camera and be fine, and and we're not really worried. Some about people it. can't exactly, and they don't even like. Some fathers probably think they're not fun. No, think they are fun, <gasps> and they're not. <gasps> they think because they come home from work and they sit on the couch and watch football for three hours and tell their kids, "Oh, did you see that touchdown?" And they're like, they think it's fun, or who knows what. But yeah. So Tyson, and, what's your come on? Let's go. What do we got? Can I please answer? Oh, we didn't put our timer on. I didn't finish answering. No, oh, you already did pass to him. Now you're gonna have to wait, Tyson. Aww. Okay. <clears throat> yes, you are a fun dad. And <laughs> why are you so nervous? Imagine you both just said no. And then the next one. No. Um, <clears throat> <clears throat> no. No. <laughs> that, that'd be kind of messed up. And then the th- some things that make you fun, One for one, is just doing this podcast. That's what makes one of the mo- main fun. things. Fun. Did you see what went on for the third? It sh- it, we have this whole studio already set up. It takes. It should take like... Five minutes. Th- two minutes to get this set up to go. It Lucky takes us like liar. 45 minutes because this one's over there singing. It does not take us 45 minutes. This one walks around singing Wu-Tang Clan and everyone's ear and screaming in the microphone. And then this one tries to record her and tries to post it to all his friends on the internet. And then she punches him and it turns into this battle royale. <laughs> and and we never get started. So, all right, go on. Sorry for interrupting. And you also take us everywhere you go, whether it's like on trips or on business trips even. You just take us wherever you go, and that's one of the main things that make you fun. And video games. I had to mention that. Great minds think alike. And to answer your question, yeah, yes. <laughs> Great minds. You Great are minds a- think alike. Well, I mean, technically... You're not a great mind, so. <laughs> but <laughs> anyway, moving on. And to give, answer your give question, one of those kicks under the table. You are a fun dad. You always bring us on your business trips and let us participate. You teach us new lessons, like literally every single day. <laughs> and you play video games with us. You literally just, just said his exact same answers. But like I said, great minds think alike. <laughs> All right, so there's a couple of okay. things, a few things. All right, so what's you, Tyson? What is your favorite thing that we do together? Pen. Drop. Okay. Uh, favorite thing uh, that we need the pen. favorite thing that we do together. I, 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 I had two down. I narrowed it down to two things. It would it would either be video games or working out. I haven't really decided, but those are like the top two things. Favorite and things. And they're that both we do like complete opposite ends. It's like one Video side games, is like chill. obsessed to training and, and like fit, and the other side's like fat, lazy turds sitting on the couch eating Cheetos all day. We don't so, eat Cheetos. So we balance things day. out. That's called work life balance. balance. Work life symmetry. All right, Midge, what's what's your favorite things that we do together? Well, favorite thing to do, my favorite thing to do to do with you would probably be traveling. Yeah, either traveling or when you and me just hang out together. I remember a time a couple years ago. Wow, that was already a couple years ago. You you and I would like, we would spend time with each other every Wednesday. And one day you asked me what I wanted to do that Wednesday. And I said, go to Home Depot. And you're like, why would you want to go to Home Depot though? Because, you know, no no normal seven-year-old girl would want to go to Home Depot with their dad. I'm like, to get wood. I think you were even younger than seven. You were like five. That was like four or five that years ago. That was back ago. when we lived on. <laughs> that, uh, that's what At this address saying. with this bank account number and social security number. And this is the blood type. And this is uh, our, everything else. <laughs> so, yeah. But, yeah. So, I said to buy wood so we can build stuff But together travel together? Nails. Do you mean like on a, like a long trip? Like on a plane? Cause that's well, not what we, we don't just do we, together. But we would I never do that really. T- I, that's something we should do though. Like you and me can. Go so there you go. There's a note we have to take. We have to do just you and me do a trip together and leave or these maybe, uh, and leave these other suckers don't. behind. Or maybe please don't. Maybe we can even do like an RV trip on our own. That'd be fun. And we'll leave these suckers behind. It's always just me and him going to do stuff. We're gonna leave them here. Or me and her. They could do the, all these Russian. other stuff. Oh, God. But also, you like what I uh, uh, thought of when you were just saying is you don't even like even not just a traveling. Like when I just had to go to the sheriff's department just to pick up the new updated concealed carry department. you like want to come with me so bad just the two of us go drive that it's like our thing going to the sheriff's department one time so all odd. the deputies they were there and they waved to me and that real sheriff was there and he also waved to me are you okay okay very exciting that the sheriff Yay! waved to you and then we went there just the other day to pick up the updated concealed carry license to add a couple of more CCW. little toys onto it and there's like this tray, candy. there's this tray of actual candy, like chocolates. And the lady's like, 
Oh, if you, why don't you ask your dad if you can have one of those? So she goes over there. It's kind of behind a wall because they take your picture. It takes like 30 seconds. So she's just taking the picture and printing up the card for me so they can't really see the bowl of candy. So they probably didn't see what happened to that bowl of candy. And as we're leaving, they say to you, they're like, hey, uh, sweetie, why don't you take one for the road? And she says to the lady, oh, I've already taken plenty for the road. <laughs> she, well, wiped, she actually said plenty. Yes. Or multiple or something similar plenty. to that. Plenty, I think was the word. She wiped them out. You know, like in Halloween and those families that the houses that put the bowl of the candy on the doorstep. And they say only take one take handful. One, but you each. can't wipe them out. You have to. You take a. No one's gonna only take one. But you also shouldn't be the jerk that takes a whole bucket and pours it because then no one else gets any. Two good meaty Maybe chunky 40. handfuls. Like meaty chunky. Like, meaty no, chunky like handfuls. Two, like two of like these handfuls. Like I have, my handfuls uh, there's like one rule that I live by. I never want to be the first one, and I never want to be the last one. If like you don't do want to be the first one to do it or the one to finish it. So you'll leave like a little, yeah. Like when you eat my leave stuff, you'll leave dud. like a little speck of something there left over. Leave to one see if milk someone dud. Wants it. All right, so. What's a milk dud? You don't know what a milk dud is. You know All right, here's another one. What's what's something you wish, Tyson, you'll go first on this. What's something you wish that we did? And when I say we, I just mean us individually by ourselves that we did more of together. What do you think? What do you wish we did more of together? And this is a question you didn't know I was going to ask because I wanted to see what you come up with on the spot. If you come up with something before him, Midge, you can jump in. If you, I know. What do you have? After oh, I had a while, but... we stopped having our little trips where you and me would like hang out together on Wednesdays. But that would be fun if we could do that more often. And, the, and you just said like do an RV trip or something yeah. by ourselves or even jump on a plane and go on some like cool vacation, do all kinds of cool stuff. Go on like a cruise or something. We'll just go. Let's go. Mitch, let's go by ourselves. Yeah. They could sit back here and, I don't know, call their family and stuff. Please don't. I mean, yeah. All right, Tyson, what's something you wish we did more of together? Maybe more like planned business meetings because we spend a lot of time like. <laughs> You're such a loser. Like hanging like, out. Who wishes they could. <laughs> have business meetings. He wishes like- he had more, <laughs> more planned. Because like. Sometimes just have him like randomly. Planned, so, planned business, business meetings. Well, because that. that's he's that's, like literally that's, such a nerd. One of his birthday presents was this hundred dollar mouse because it's like a productivity mouse. No, it and was ninety nine dollars like, and ninety eight cents. And it's like the coolest thing ever. And I have the same mouse because he saw don't my mouse and he wanted me. the same one. Don't and I knew he'd want the same one, so I ordered two of them. You didn't even know it. But a hundred dollar mouse for the computer because it does all kinds of weird functions and downloadable. You could program it however you want to. So many so, buttons. So more planned business meetings is something you wish we could do more of together. So like what all right, what anything else come to mind? Who wants to hear a joke? Oh boy, here we go. What do we got? Okay. First one. Why can't you ever trust artists? I know the answer to this one. She whispered it to me in my ear. It is so bad. You said you wanted to steal it from me. Is it figure outable? Yes. There's a fly in here that is driving me crazy. Yes, but it's a bit Punny. Watch your peas in that microphone. It's a bit punny. No, watch your peas. Mute her. What is the question again? But my... And then mute her. What was the question again? Why can't you trust artists? Mute when, her. When, when, no, no. <laughs> when, when I did the pee on that question, though, it literally peaked. I know, because I'm telling you not to do it, and that is a very annoying on the, on the sound. Can I get the question again, please? Why can't you ever trust artists? Why can't you ever trust artists? Is that correct? Is that the question? Okay. Why can't you ever trust artists? Stop stalling. Painting, drawing, starving. Uh, give me a hint. I don't know. Give me a hint. You have to do Give that. me a hint. Okay. Thanks. You know what that Thanks sound is called? Mary. M-A-R-Y. Uh-huh. Mary? Yeah. How is that Mary? I don't know. Who's Mary? And why is she making that sound? She's like a complete failure in life. I know. All right, give me a hint. Give me a hint to, to the joke. What is another word for a quick drawing? Because they're sketchy. 
God. So I get half a point for that, at least. Half a point. Because I figured yeah, out with the hint. Yeah, points recently. I know, because we only do like one or two jokes because we have so much other stuff we always go over. All right, so we talked about am I fun? What makes me what makes me fun? What's your favorite thing we do together? What would you wish we did more of together? And he wants to have more <laughs> business <laughs> meetings. Planned business meetings. Stop screaming into your mic. Planned. Wow. All right, so let's see. What all right, what do you wish we did more of than as a whole family? Maybe No, I'm just kidding. I, I I could answer. Horse riding cuz I'm like the really only one in the family that does it and we've only done like once i think the whole family we went that's in the other country where tyson's horse yeah. took off like just took off into the mountains and it wouldn't listen to anyone remember and my horse like full like speed like, i almost like, died we didn't even have horse, helmets on there was not even like any straps we were like just jumping on these horses like, there's we no we seat doing. belts on a saddle though and we had no helmet nothing we just jumped on some horse in some mountains in some other country and that shit just said pew and took off <laughs> my horse was named flashlight Flashlight. Wait, actually? Yes. How the hell do you remember your horse's name? I don't know, but my horse wasn't listening either. He was like tripping and All right, he so would not go riding. faster. Well, our property here is capable of housing horses and yeah, on me in the middle of a show, I have a band-aid. <clears throat> our, our house is capable of having horses if we had built up our credibility and discipline and everything else. We could have a horse out there and go practice in your own yard. Literally, you could you could be riding a horse every day in your own yard and up and down the street. The sidewalks are literally made for horses in our neighborhood. Why, why are you guys All right, Tyson. at me? What's something that you wish we did more of as a family? Video games. We literally do that all the time. No, oh, as all a whole four family? of us, we never do that. We play like those. Our, our, the Russian is too busy watching makeup tutorials. <laughs> Makeup tutorials. That's what she was doing last night instead of playing what? Minecraft with us. Makeup tutorials. But you don't, there's not many that even the three of us, because then you, because yeah. I'm not playing Minecraft and you, you could play Ark. You could play My, Border, Mike Borderlands. Can play Ark. Borderlands I used to, that actually might be Border, uh, Borderlands is the reason we created that other account for money. Remember? So we could do all four or someone has to be on a split screen. We have, three, image. we have three TVs. All right. So that's anything else for any of those that come to mind. We have it's a little more to go. But if you think about it, there's Tyson- some hard ones coming up still. Oh yeah, one is like I'm afraid to ask. So Eric, right, oh, as we're th- doing this, no, like, did like, anything else? Think- did anything else? I have something did, on the video games topic. Did anything else come up in on? All right, what makes me fun? On what's your favorite stuff we do together? What do you wish we did more of together? What do you wish per, one-on-one more of together? And what do we wish we did more of together as a family? Any other things? Not on the, the same ones. Any other things come to mind? If not, then move on. No. That's it. That's all you guys got. Great. All right. What's something you really want to do or something like hard or something you want to accomplish or a goal, like something big, like scary, impossible that you think you want to do? And I'm not saying your entire life, like, somewhere in the next nearish type future like meaning while you're still a kid or like not a grown-up not an adult like somewhere in the next few before several, 18 maybe yeah i guess that would fit into there what's something either climb mount san gorgonia twice in a row or do another 24-hour push-up challenge just 24-hour push-up is the one you came mine up with? would be get freak fit to make 10k a month a month nice but what about all right? What else? More than that, I'm sure you guys okay. come up with some more stuff. Like something hard, something impossible, something like very difficult. Even it doesn't have to be a. It, it could be a physical challenge. It could be a goal. It could be a, a work challenge. We always thought about challenge. this, and we researched about it. You need to be 16 in order to do a hundred mile race. And I was, and I've been thinking. That's about what I was that. thinking of. Hundred mile that's, race. That's what I thought your answer would be. Hundred mile race or a hundred mile. A hundred mile, like the ones up like in the mountains. Leadville or something like that, or. Bad Badwater is like 135. I'm pretty sure, so it's a little longer. But that's the one in what Death Valley? I think that one's the Badwater Bad Water Basin. Death Valley, yeah, yeah. And that one's in the mountains. For me, in I would probably want to do like maybe like a 10 mile Spartan race. Oh yeah, Spartan race, yeah. Like a longer one. I've only done a two mile one before. That's the only Spartan. All right. Race I've done. Anything to add to any of that stuff before we go to the final question of the day? Oh, no. let's, do it. let's do it. Let's do the final question. Why do you breathe like that? No one wants to hear that. We don't want to hear it. The 
three people out there listening don't want to hear that, like it's annoying. I'm I'm breathing like like Mr. Hulk over here. All right, here's the question for whoever wants to go first. What are you doing? <laughs> what? Yes. Can you put that down? Yes. What is the hardest part about being my kid? We may have to edit some of this part out. We'll see how this goes. We're not going raw today. What is the hardest part about being my kid? That is my final question for this first part of 15 things fathers want to know about their kids. Can we just say ahem, no on this one? <laughs> like, no. <clears throat> okay, hardest no. part. No. You, we definitely don't need your volume no. kicked up like that. Yours needs to be toned down a bit. A little bit lower decibel. Hardest thing. What do you got? Anyone? No, so there's no hard part no, about no, no, my no. kids. Yes, I'm, I'm thinking. Browsing through all. Of see, some of these I didn't want to give you purposely because I want to see what you come up with. Teaching to have responsibility because I have a lot of responsibilities, like pets, like a ton of different things with business and stuff like that. So I think I that'd have be two things actually. I think He's that'd not in the middle be, of talking. Sorry, I think that'd be one of them. Like teaching to have responsibility, but then having those responsibilities gives me freedom. So. What do you mean yeah. teaching how to have responsibility? That's the And how to maintain part. them. So having responsibility? What do you mean teaching? What, like having, yeah, having responsibilities probably. For me. And lots of them. That's the hardest part is having the responsibilities? For yeah, me. Because working out is not hard because I love doing it. I love working out, so it's not unnecessary. You mentioned your pets. You mentioned your pet. Didn't you say something about the pets? Yeah. So you don't love doing the stuff with the pets? No, no, no. I love oh. doing it. So that should be easy. Okay. What else? That's just, that's included in responsibilities. So responsibilities, like there is, and we do, we have, and I ask all the time, I give him the option. I say, do you want me to give you extra above and beyond responsibilities of a normal average sitting around the house? This is when you're like 10 or whatever the year is, 13 year old, but also have then the same lack of freedoms and lack of decision making and lack of everything that you have. Money or, making. Or, Less and less, and it's a choice. Like, do you want this extra? Can you handle a little more? Can you handle a little more responsibility, a little more pressure? Because that's what's going to make you a successful adult. So keeping track of your responsibilities. So we need to take notes on that and see how we can help you keep track of your responsibilities because you forget sometimes this. You do the, all the hard stuff and you'll forget like the simplest little things because you overlook Laundry. them. Laundry. Because you're thinking of the small stuff. And then I'm running around barefoot because I have no socks. But then I look in your drawer and you've got like half your drawers filled with my freaking socks. Allegedly. Allegedly. Yeah. Snitches end up in ditches. All right, Midge, what is the I hardest part? Oh. oh, I thought she was going to have like a laundry list. <laughs> like just listed like dozens of things. What is I was the browsing through the laundry what list. What is the hardest part of being my kid? Think about it, when is a parent ever would ask a kid like that, especially live on camera, mic'd up. But that note. Headphones. I'm gonna, and then Either. I'm going to answer the hardest part about being your father is watching you fiddle <laughs> and not an smack band. your hand, just fiddling for no reason. I can't stand fiddlers. I can't stand people that eat with their mouth open or put their hands in their mouth. Yeah, just, GD. Just do like all this fiddling stuff. Like control yourself. For Wait a minute, me, this wasn't about my answer. Sorry, I lost track and I got off track for a second. two things for me would either be... You're very be, eager to answer this one. Would either be earning credibility... Because one time I got a streak of like 61 days in a row of working out and I maintained a fairly well attitude for the whole time. Fairly well. And then one, one day I kind of half sort of worked out and I thought I counted. And then at the end of the day, he's like, it didn't count. So that's how I lost my streak. Incredibility? Okay. Or how we have to work out before we can play video games. That's, that's the hardest part of being my kid. I'm, one. Of I must be pretty parts. damn good if that's the only hard part of being a kid that I make no you way. actually earn playing video games. So not bad. I thought the answer was going to be a lot worse than that. We're gonna what have do you mean a lot? Like I said, I browse through the laundry list. Browse through the laundry list. All right. And we have any anything to wrap up? Any other thing to wrap up with? No, we don't have another joke. Okay. Tyson, you're supposed to give you're a supposed joke. to have a joke each. No, you don't have a joke. <gasps> See, here we go. Okay, but look, it's, look, look, but look, it's look, hard look, being look, my look, kid look, for the results of it. You can't remember look. to have a joke ready for every I left, episode. I left all my jokes on my computer and I forgot to transfer them to my notebook. 
Can you read the English language, sir? Can you read this out loud for me? What says right across this broken arm of mine? I can, I can. Read it out loud, please. No excuses. Exactly. <laughs> I just, I forgot. And and if the, I was expecting, I don't know, something else that I was like, okay, I need to do something about that. But the stuff you guys said, if it wasn't on me that much, I was expecting more of something on me. Like the hardest part of being my kid is you being responsible. Remember to bring your jokes or do your laundry. That's So it wasn't too bad. And hers was that earn you, have to, you have to earn credibility. Which is, on, which is on you, you, which is on you. No, it was just on you. He has credibility. I don't think he could do every once even before he works out because he we know he's going to work out. We know it's a guarantee. Like you don't even have to think about it. 920 days of working out straight. But let me ask no, you, you if you're working the treadmill. But let me ask you if you're working out oh. with me and the whole time you're like on a skateboard with some Viking helmet on with like a, a unicorn tied around a rope, like a noose and dragging it while you're rolling around the thing instead of doing a workout. If you're doing that when yeah. you're with me during the workout, and I see that's what you're doing a workout. Do you see how, do you think it's unreasonable for you to think maybe you're not quite as focused if you go uh, say you're going to work out on your own? No. <laughs> no. All right. So that, ep- that wraps up when, ep- when you asked for, if part had- one of 15 things that fathers want to know about their kids. Let's, Take them home. When you home. asked if we had a joke, Tyson was like tapping me. Like, Let's what do you want? Let's take them home. If you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure you click that subscribe button and smash that like button. And click the notification bell so you never miss out on any future videos. And make sure you ask your questions some kids, either on camera or not on camera. And just make sure you if subscribe. If you do put them on line, then tag us in it and, and no show us what you came up with. So let me break, break, break it all down for you. I never give it up, I never give it up. You know I'm gonna take, take, taking that crown from you. I ain't worried about you, I ain't never So let me break, break, break it all down for you. I never give it up, I never give it up. You know I'm gonna take, take, taking that crown from you. I ain't worried about you.